Do you know how many types of dinosaurs existed? Isn't it thrilling to think about the world of dinosaurs? These fascinating creatures roamed our Earth, not hundreds, not thousands, but millions of years ago. There were so many different types of dinosaurs, each with its unique traits and abilities. But did you know that all these dinosaurs can be divided into two main groups? Yes, just two! These groups are based on their hip structure, a bit like how we have different types of dogs based on their size or fur. The first group is called Saurischia. This group includes giants like the Tyrannosaurus rex and the long-necked Brachiosaurus. The second group is the Ornithischia, home to dinosaurs like the Triceratops and the armored Ankylosaurus. Amazing, isn't it? How about we dive deeper and learn about some specific dinosaurs? Have you ever heard of the T-Rex or Triceratops? Well, let's get to know them better. The Tyrannosaurus rex, affectionately known as T-Rex, was one of the largest meat-eating dinosaurs. Picture a creature as long as a school bus, towering over us with teeth the size of bananas. Yes, the T-Rex was a formidable predator. Interestingly, it belonged to a group of dinosaurs known as Saurischians, which means lizard-hipped. Now, let's meet the Triceratops. This dinosaur was famous for its three horns and large frill which it possibly used for defense. Imagine a dinosaur as big as an elephant, but with a solid shield on its head. That's the Triceratops for you. It belonged to an entirely different group from the T-Rex, known as Ornithischians, which means bird-hipped. Wow, those were some incredible dinosaurs, but wait, we have more to discover. Are you ready to meet more dinosaurs? Let's dive right in. First up, we have the Brachiosaurus, a massive, long-necked, long-tailed dinosaur that was taller than three giraffes stacked on top of each other. It was a plant eater, or herbivore, munching on leaves from the tallest trees. Isn't that incredible? Now, the Brachiosaurus belonged to a group of dinosaurs called Saurischians, which means lizard-hipped. These dinosaurs had hips that looked more like those of modern-day lizards. Next, meet the Stegosaurus, another herbivore. But this one had large, bony plates along its back and sharp spikes on its tail for defense. Stegosaurus was part of the Ornithischian group, or bird-hipped dinosaurs, which had hips similar to those of birds. Can you imagine seeing these dinosaurs in real life? And that's just a peek into the world of dinosaurs. There were so many more, each unique and fascinating in their own way.